Dear participants, I want to I'm ready to meet you here. So I want to start with my theme about Bashkir Wikipedia. In 2010, an article about the Bashki Wikipedia and its active editors was published in the Republican Youth magazine Shongar. It was the first article about Wikipedia in the Republican media. And today the events of the Bashkir's Wikipedia are covered by the Republican media resources. In 2011-2012, with the support of colleagues from other language sections, they mastered the method of bot uploads, and for the first time among the small sections of Russia, this method was used. In September 2011, articles about all rural settlements of Bashkortostan were uploaded. Using this method, stop articles were created about the municipalities of Germany, the countries of the world, and the rivers of Russia. On April 2021, in Almaty, at the Kazakh National University named Dr. Al Farabi, the first conference of Turkic uh, Wikimedia was held, organized by the official representative of the Wikipedia, Wikipedia Foundation in Kazakhstan. So, the Bashkir Forum began to regularly publish news reports about events in the life of the section. In 2015, in the main building of the Bashkir State University, with the support of the Institute of History, Language and Literature, and Bashkir State University, the Open International Scientific and Practical Conference, Wikipedia and the Information Society was held. The project events were dedicated to the 10th anniversary of the Bashkir Wikipedia. The conference was attended by administrators of small sections of Wikipedia created in the languages of the peoples of Russia and the world from Ukraine, Poland, Russian regions, Bashkortostan, Tatarstan, Chechnya, Tumen, so on. A public figure, writer, writer, writer and Wikipedian, Siddikova Guzel Ramazanovna, through social networks called to become volunteers of the Bashkir Wikipedia, she later wrote, help Rustam and Zufar supplement the Bashkir Wikipedia. Then we were joined by older people who have enough free time. Jokingly, they were called Wiki Grandmothers. At the Wiki Ural Seminar in 2016, I made a report on the unique phenomenon of the Bashkir Wikipedia. The Bashkir Wikipedia is dominated by women, while over the world, Wikipedians are mostly men. In 2017 in Berlin, Eileen Wissam introduced Wiki grandmothers to the global Wikimedia community in, tw in 2019. The project became the winner and the nomination best social initiative of the all-Russian contest keyword organized by the federal agency. On September 2015, at the Con Wiki conference in Tartu in Estonia, a meeting was held with a senior official of the Navy, Asaf Bartov, on the further development of Wiki project in the Bashkir language and the creation of a Bashkir user group. In 
2015, the Bashkir User Group was recognized by the Wikimedia Foundation. Thus, the Wikipedians of Bashkortostan Group became the 49th in the world list of such groups and the only one in Russia at that time. In the future, the Bashkir Youth Group uh, held several meetings and f field conferences. The most significant events were Wiki Seminar Yangam Tao is a training event for the exchange of experience and the translation of system message from Wikimedia projects into the Bashkir language. The seminar was held from March 25 to April 3rd, 2016, at the resort Yangan Tau, located in the Salavatsky district of the Republic of Bashkortostan. In the same year, Wiki Yailai, Wiki Summer, was brought to the Burzansky district. Bashkir Wikipedians achieve good results in international Russian competitions such as Wiki Spring, Asia Month, Alumnian Mentors. We also hold various, various competitions in our section. The largest project was the competition dedicated to the 100th anniversary of the formation of the Bashkir Soviet Autonomy. The competition began in the September 2016 and ended in December 2018. It was held then it was held in five stages in 100 days each. You can see here you can see here the pictures so what else I want to add is is that uh, the high activity of the Bashkir Wikimedia volunteers in recent years has been noted. So during all these years, the goal of our community has become not only to write Wikipedia in the Bashkir language, but also to involve as many people as possible in the project, create conditions for the development of the native language, and expand the possibility of its use. So here you can see the gift uh, then I want to tell you about Rustam Nuriyev. Okay, then uh, there are more than 60,000 articles in the Bashkis today. In terms of the number of articles were significantly interior to other sections. But according to a number of indications, indicators, such as rating in the list of a thousand required the depth of the article, the average size of the article, we are on a pair with the most developed Wikipedians in the world. Everything of this were mentioned in Wikipedia. To motivate new participants, we present certificates of participation in the forum or competition. So, to motivate new participants, we present certificates, we perform on radio and TV. This year, several times, participated in the morning TV show. Wikipedia was advertised in a radio quiz show. Okay. 
So Bashuki has more than 60,000 60, publications that I said. So Bashki Wikipedia is one of the most developed wiki in Wikimedia and in the field of linguistic. So thanks to the Bashkir Wikipedia, the Bashkir language became part of two global projects in computational linguistics. So how is the Bashkir Wikipedia is written mainly by the same people, new editors appear very rarely. To motivate new participants, we present certificates in the forum and we are doing the competition. So we have 10 programs. So at the intellectual TV game, Alton Time, in the third round, they asked a question from Wikipedia. So we're asking for the help colleagues from other Wikipedias, provide them with technical and moral support, and we hope other sections of Wikipedia will take our experience. And the time has come to create the center of support of the Turkic-speaking Wikipedia movement. In Germany, there is a large center that organizes various events that contribute to the activities of the volunteer movement. Zaytuna will come in now. Hello, my name is Zaytuna. I'm one of volunteers as you. I give you the information about Wikidata. Its name is Universal Cards Plus and Pros and Cons. In 2017, and Wiki Grandmothers went to Moscow for International Wiki Conference and there was a meeting and speaker was Sergei Lishina Wikipedian and he gave us the information about Wiki data and then after his meeting we want to go for his master class and what he said he asked us he asked us he asked us to take the examples and to replace them with universal universal ex examples and Bashkirian Wikipedia was chosen for ex experiment and we were experiment place from 2017 when we're translating from other languages to our language we're using universal card and how we are motivated our volunteers and editors this card is universal which show us all the data from wiki data when we wrote UK all the data is coming and it's showing in the cart. This cart is coming by itself. We're not translating anything. And we're motivating them in this way. If you will translate the data with legs to Bashkirian language, and you will put this universal cart, the other volunteers do not knowing the Bashkirian language, they will read the, uh, 
They will read the data in Wikidata. They will be able to read it. And last year, for the first time, we're, we held Wiki competition. This competition was about writing the articles. And we checked not only the, sta the statements, but also the Wikidata. So we worked in two projects. We did such a trick. We give for one statement 0 0.5, and for Wikidata we gave one point, and for filling this we give 1.10. And when somebody wants to write a big statement, they were first in this competition. And these days, in these years, using universal card, we have some conclusions. First, we want, if we want to take correct data, we should translate it into our language. We have only 20 people working, and there are Wiki grandmothers in our community. Second, when we are using examples, it gave us time to fill the card, the universal card. Sometimes we can delete something and this card will be invalid for a work. It will be mistaken. And the Wikipedians can see and find the failures, but the newcomers, new beginners, they cannot find the problem. And it is the problem without solution, and they can go. Third one, when we're using Ukraine card, we can see all the data which is not written yet. Why is good? Because now you can see untranslated the data and translate it into your language. And I, if I'll find it, you can find in your gadgets Edgar Lega. He is in all languages and check in other languages the, how it's shown, how the card is shown. For example, in English, Wikipedia, in Azerbaijanian, in Kazakh, and in Bashkiri Wikipedia. The others worked with card with their cards, and we worked in universal cards. And all is written in Wiki in Bashkir Wikipedia shown is shown in our cards. So we have the examples, such example, which is give which gives us the difference with one thousand bytes. That's why when we are holding the competitions we are adding the amount of words not by bytes but by the words you can see it as well. We have only one record, one example. UK, two letters, but others have all the pages with cards. And fifth, when we're using UK, and if there is no sample, it's written with red, in red. Wikidata is not filled. So the user should work in the project, he should write the statements, he should fill the Wikidata in order him to take the correct card. And what is cons? When we're changing the traditional cards into UK, there might be some lags. And the user should use the old samples, but it's not the solution. In this case, we should we should improve the modern card. Now, the Bashkir language in Bashkir language, 2,000 elements are not translated yet. 
but this conclusion was made by Sergei Lishina. Uh, so we have the links, and with these links we can translate these elements, but I think there is not only 2,000 elements. We can translate all the, we can translate everything, we can translate all the elements. You can see Edgar Dego, you can see it, you can check it in the website. Please show the card in Bashkir language. Show us the card in Bashkir language and in other languages. So we use the universal card, which is UK, UC. This is the card in English, in Azerbaijani. You can see in Azerbaijani. So you should fill the sample with by hand, but in Bashkir, Vicky, we can use not our hands, but we can use your C, universal card. You can see it here. You? Okay. The second one says, when we are participating to the concourse, they they're using old samples, they're using old cards, and we're using modern cards, and there might be some differences, some differences in bytes. And sometimes they're not putting, they're not adding the wiki data into wiki. And when we're using more time, we're wasting our time, and the results came same. So in conclusion, let's say you see Universal Card doing, helping us to reduce the time. Thank you so much for your attention. Means. Thank you. I want to so thank you, all of you. But we have some gifts. I want to start with Mr. Asaf because he's helping us. It's our Bashkir honey. And I used to tell Mehman, he is our curator, he is our head, he is our guide. This is for Mehman. And of course, our organizers is Turkish side, Zafar, Mr. Zafar, and Ms. Bashak. Please, Mr. Zafar. Thank you. Ms. Bashak, Ms. Bashak, please, this is for you. And we talk between us with one jam. And Mr. Zafar, who is there? Information about Zaki Validi. He is Turkic scientist. And today morning, our friend from Rajab from Azerbaijan told that Zaki was bored in Istanbul, and we can go there in 30 minutes to the place he was bored. Please, Rajab. Rahmat. Thank you.